Welcome to our XBOMS 9 Editor Highlights video, which will showcase some of the interactive graphical editors which are available across the XBOMS application modules and which make it easy to document and manage the increasingly complex information making up today's sophisticated ITC environments. The Infrastructure Editor can display a combination of simple drawing elements and any XBOMS database objects placed on a background image. Hyperlink symbols provide a direct access to lower level drawings, such as floor and data center area plans. The area plan editor provides a bird's eye view of data center layouts, complete with customer definable grids, different area types and automatically drawn distribution cabinet icons. All items shown in the plan are database objects. That's why tooltips are displayed with key information when doing a mouse over. User-definable additional information, such as the power status or the utilization of rec units within the distribution cabinets, can be quickly displayed by activating overlay icons, which reflect values directly accessed from the database. With the help of the sophisticated smart search feature, we make it easy to find just what you are looking for. This is true even for complex analyses, such as Show me only those distribution cabinets in the plan which contain active components for which IPv6 has already been rolled out. From any plan, drill down in order to show more detailed information. By a contextual menu, launch the RecView Editor to access a real-time graphical representation of a distribution cabinet, the components it contains, and their child components. Open the RecView Editor's rear view in order to see the component's rear sides, which often carry their connections. Connected ports are highlighted in green. Access further useful information by displaying the distribution cabinet's frame areas, which often contain power components such as PDUs. Also, take a look at the virtual machines a host server provides by activating the virtual view. Check where a port is connected to by launching the single connection editor. This editor displays the complete connection path for the start port up to the first connected active component. All passive components that are part of this path are also displayed, including cable objects. Launching the Power Impact Editor provides a quick graphical overview of how this physical server is redundantly connected to phases L1 and L2 and the related objects in a power hierarchy. The green overlay icons next to the fuses indicate that there are currently no issues with the power supply. Let's return to the infrastructure editor we started out with. Some of the database objects it contains, for example icons for services, network paths and networks, provide direct access to editors from various XBOMS 9 application modules. The hierarchy editor originates with the business service management module. It displays service items, contractual information and related person objects, as well as technical components belonging to a company's service catalog. Expanding the number of levels visible reveals the potential complexity, variety and richness of information required to describe the services provided by today's IT organizations. The IPv6 matrix editor originates with the networking module. It comprises an 8-bit matrix view of a given IPv6 network and its subnet structure. You can navigate the matrix in 8-bit increments and also create new subnets from within the editor. Opening the info panel for a subnet reveals key technical and master data information next to the editor. The connectivity structure editor layer N originates with the connectivity management module. It displays end-to-end -end logical connectivity information across various nested network paths of different types and provides direct database access and further analyses to all paths and components depicted. Access the floor plan editor by double-clicking a corresponding link in the infrastructure editor. The floor plan editor displays information relevant to structured cabling, such as sockets, junctions, cable ducts, the cables deployed in the ducts, and associated technical components. You can analyze interconnected paths provided by cable ducts, 
or review the area covered by wireless access points documented in floor plans. Launch the port editor from a connected component in order to view the connections for all of its ports. By increasing the number of levels displayed, it is possible to inspect connections across multiple passive components, such as cables, patch panels, etc., all the way to the next connected active component. This concludes the XBOMS 9 Editor Highlights video. For further information and videos about XBOMS, please check our website at www.expertsoft.com. Thank you.